To find your Edpuzzle assignment, log in to your Schoology account on a computer, tablet, or mobile device. Then select your course. Your Edpuzzle assignment will be listed with all of your other class materials. Just click the assignment to access the video. Before you click play, it's important to make sure you're prepared to focus and learn. Make sure you're in a quiet space or put in headphones. Also make sure you have a pencil and paper with you so you can take notes throughout the video. If you click an assignment link and receive an error message or are asked to verify your email, please click refresh on your computer or go back and click on the assignment link again. If the error continues, please contact your teacher. Once you're ready, you may click play and begin the video. If your teacher has enabled it, you'll have an option to turn on closed captions, allowing you to see subtitles during the video. At each of these icons, the video will pause and you'll be required to answer a question. Here's a multiple choice question. If you know the answer, select it and click submit. You will receive feedback instantly telling you if you are correct. Then you can continue through the video. As you watch your assignment, make sure to pay close attention. If the video ever moves too fast, or if you need time to take notes, don't be afraid to pause or go backwards in the video. Your teacher will be able to see how long you spend on each assignment and how many times you watch each section of the video. So make sure you're taking your time and putting your full effort into each assignment. Now we're at our next question. If you know the answer, you can select it now. If you aren't sure, select Rewatch and watch the last section of video one more time. You can rewatch each section as many times as you need to understand. Once you know the answer, you may select it and will instantly get feedback. Let's keep moving. Notice that Edpuzzle will not let you skip through the video. You need to watch the entire video that you're assigned. Now here's our last question. This is an open-ended question, so we'll type our answer into the text box. There are eight cubes in this shape. You'll not get feedback on these questions because your teacher will be looking at them later. Make sure you finish the entire video you're assigned, and once you reach the end, it will automatically submit for your teacher to see and grade. You can see your grade in your Schoology gradebook, but know that this grade is not final until your teacher has finished grading your open-ended responses. Once you've completed an assignment, you can re-access the assignment and click Show Results to review all of the questions and answers. In addition, if your teacher has left comments on your work, you'll be able to see them here. If you'd like to retry an assignment to earn a better score, let your teacher know, and they can reset your progress and allow you to try again. Now you know how to use Edpuzzle with your Schoology account. Good luck!